What do you want me to get of you? I don't know. What do you think? What would be cute? Like a let's go in. I don't know. Like a. Yep. Yep. <laughs> oh. Okay. Tell us a little bit about this place. So I'm from Buffalo East. We're originally from Buffalo, New York. Um, we came out here about two years ago. We started this brand. Uh, we had a lot of dreams of just coming up with a good takeout restaurant with good hospitality and good great quality food. Uh, we specialize in things like Philly cheesesteaks, loaded fries, chicken wings, uh, hot dogs, burgers. And we have the best almost one of the best signature sauces in the city right now. Yeah. We have over 30 flavors of wings. So if you're in the area and you're here, make sure you check us out at 505 North Triumph Street. We're open until midnight mostly every day. Weekends we're available until 1 a.m. My favorite item is always going to be like the, anything under, under really the hot subs, like the Philly cheesesteaks okay. are really popular. Or I, that's one of my personal items that I really like. I like the chopped cheese. So the chopped cheese is basically like a smoked burger, beef burger chopped up just like a Philly with grilled onions, banana peppers, mayo cheese, and our signature hot sauce. One of my other favorites is going to be obviously the smoked wings I was telling you ladies about. Yeah. Especially the, the smoked buffalo wings, or the honey garlic smoked wings, or the uh, the mango habanero, but I like to add lemon pepper to them. Okay. So those are really popular, or my personal favorite, I should say. And the loaded fries. The loaded fries are killer. We're right? excited about those. Yeah. Let's go, ladies. Ready? Let's do this. Hell yeah. Oh my god. Yes. Then we're gonna put our hot sauce on there. So this is our signature sauce. They love this stuff. Okay, so this is the one that you think we should try with the blue cheese, right? Yes. Okay, so this is the Loganberry. Loganberry. Okay. Loganberry with blue cheese. Blueberries and red raspberries. Blueberries and red raspberries. And red raspberries. Okay, are you ready? Yeah, I'm going with a flat. A flat? I go with flat. Incorrect. <laughs> Cheers. Hi, birthday. I'm a flat. What are you? I'm a flat. You're a flat? Okay. Well, we, we just have learned you. <laughs> okay. We're ready. Got this. Alright. Here's you. Thank you. Man, you tell me how to go. Oh, my God. Unbelievable. Oh my god, the winds are super crispy on the outside. Oh my god. Okay, when I pull around, I'm going to show you. Why I'm going to show you. The people that might be able to be laid up on you, I'm going to look at that. 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 I'm going to look
Like, ain't no way proof when she's gonna make it work. These are amazing. No notes. We are trying. Um, not ready yet. Um, oh, sorry. Well, I'm, I'll still talk to my video. Oh. Oh, say what up. I'm oh, sorry. Hi. Hey. hey. Ali and Rebecca in today. Hello, hello. Visiting Buffalo East. It's Rebecca's birthday. It is my birthday. My birthday. And Ali's in the building. Hi. What are you trying today? We are trying all kinds of stuff. We got buffalo wings. We got the Loganberry wings, which these are insane. We already housed one of them. Absolutely insane. Those are probably the best wings I've ever had. Okay. No notes. Absolutely no notes. Right. What else um, you got going? We've got a whole bunch of sandwiches to try. We've got... A stinger sub, I believe. Uh-huh. We've got a chopped cheese. I'm very excited about that. Mm -hmm. Apparently, it's the best one ever. We got, we got some, some loaded fries. fries. Y'all, with a the dab of, sauce on them. With a dab of that sour cream on there. Just a, a little dab. dab. <laughs> that is that is that the is appropriate. The right proportion. That is yes. the appropriate amount of sour cream. Just everyone take notes. Gotcha. We're, we're very excited. Well, we're excited to do this video, and we will be dropping soon. So be in tune, okay? All right. Buffalo eats. See ya. I'm going ranch this time. Me too. In solidarity. Yep. I'm with the Tangy. Mm. Lightly spicy. Again, crispy on the outside. She can handle very little spice, so she probably gonna start sniffling. My nose is already running. <laughs> That's good though. Mm -hmm. It's like one of those things, like a buffalo flavor. It's one of those things that like I know it's gonna make my nose run, but I love it anyway. It hurts a little bit, we're okay with it. It's so good. Mm -hmm. My nose is running. <laughs> you went out. Okay. Yeah, I mean, you have a little bit of mascara in different places, but I mean, it's not going to be super noticeable. You can get away from it. And you're both down. Yeah. <laughs> Sweating. Okay. Yeah. So, we're back. we're back. Oh no. Allie is sensitive to spice, and the buffalo is a little too spicy for her. But it is a true medium. But the flavor. Yeah, they have a mild. So, if, <laughs> if buffalo itself is too much for you, you can just go mild. Okay. Mild gets all the tang without the heat, okay? So, now we have the covered fries. These loaded fries. Loaded fries. This loaded is the fries. one with steak. I can see peppers. Their home, their house sauce, which I don't know what the flavor is for that yet. Cheese, sour cream. We're really excited about it. The works, everything. <laughs> a food. I. <laughs> she just died at the buffalo. She's so sensitive to spice. The I buffalo is a little too much for her. The most sensitive. I know. Don't make fun of me. I thought it was amazing. The buffalo isn't even that hot. It's not. I know. I know. She's a. A baby palette with spice. I listen, is I have house, no control over my body. Is your house sauce spicy? No. No, okay. I love it. The flavor is amazing. I have no control over what my body is doing no. right now. Are we they Chinese? Are, yeah, but they also have great Fanta. I just like the oh, we're really excited. Know, people need to know they have great Rebecca Fanta. wants everybody to know that they have great Fanta. Yes. Okay. Are we ready? Yes. Loaded fries. I want to get a bite with everything in it. Oh absolutely. That's the only way to do it. Only way to do it. Ah. We got thirty five making a mess everywhere. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> Are your phone dying? Yeah. yeah. It's always dying. Okay. Yes. Cheers. <laughs> I keep forgetting to cheers you. I just go straight for it. Mm. Oh. oh my god. Oh my god. Those are so good. <laughs> that has some kind of like mustard base to it. I love mustard. I do too. Wow. It's not like yellow super tangy mustard it's like a deeper mustard sauce the sour cream really makes it different oh my god this is so, so good the beef is really flavored i love this <laughs> no we're moving to buffalo 
is a Super Bowl, <laughs> that would be a buy it. Okay. Mm. Rebecca, yeah. You can't take these home. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. That's a yes. No notes. You know what those are good with? <laughs> a Fanta grape soda. Sponsor us, Fanta. We still have so much more to try. All right, what do you want to try first? The sausage? The... Let's do some sausage. Okay. Some sausage. So do you remember what he said about these? They get the sausages straight from Buffalo. They do, and they are... Come and hit me, bro. Okay, Camellia's beef sausage. These, okay, so these are, specifically these are beef sausages, not pork sausages, these are beef sausages, okay? And they're, they look really good. They get grill marks on them. Cheers. Look at them. Oh my god. Mm. Do a big bite. That is so good. That sausage has a lot of flavor in it. Mm, good. Mm. I love everything about that. <laughs> yeah, that was really tasty. Like, it's a really packed sausage. Um, <laughs> to put it bluntly, this is a sturdy wiener. I mean, this is a sturdy sausage. It's a big boy. It's a big boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know I love a deli sandwich. Yeah, this is definitely more your range, but he did say it's like a honey deli. My honey turkey. Favorite. Mm. The bread is nice and crusty on the bottom. A little crusty. Um, a little getting crusty. How can I say? Do you want me to just tear a bite off or you oh, want? Sure. No, no. Okay. No, just bite it. Bite it. Okay. Bite it. Just bite it. Just bite it. Mmm. Taste. Mmm. Mm-hmm. I can't wait. immediately when it comes down. You taste. You taste the sweet turkey. And then the um, the Italian flavor. oregano and oil and vinegar. Mm. 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 Everything's mm. fresh mm. and cold. Mm. Mm. That's a good deli sandwich. There is a great. That is a great deli sandwich. That, deli is, sandwich, that right? is a genuine reaction. This, that's like my favorite thing in the world. It's just like a sub, just like a plain yeah, ass yeah, sub. Yeah, yeah. Not plain ass sub. You know what I mean? Oh, that's so good. The backstory about Buffalo eats so. When I was 18, so me and my family, we actually opened up a small convenience store. And we had, uh, it was a small convenience store with just like some essentials, groceries, stuff like that. And we had a, a small kitchen in there, but we were only making deli subs. Okay. So, uh, and we had a salad bar as well. So at the time, we would make deli sandwiches, but we were using Boris Head brand deli sandwiches. Yeah. And, um... People were just hooked on the food the first time they tried it because everybody was like using cheaper uh, ingredients, like as far as their deli sandwiches. Yeah. And uh, so when we were using Borset, it was very different to the customer, yeah. especially we brought it to like a honestly like a low income yeah. area, you know. Yeah. So like they were hooked on it because of the quality of the food. Yeah. So I knew I had something yeah. good, but it was like we're in the wrong city because it was like so much competition around us and. Sure. The weather was horrible because it's like cold half the year. But we had great clientele, but That's at fair. the same time, business was slow because like, you know, you'd wake up, you had three feet of snow in front of your store, you yeah. know what I mean? <laughs> it was horrible. So we just had to come out here and just do something different. Oh, but this okay. time we did a hot kitchen concept as well. Yeah. And that's why we have like, you know, things like hot food and fried oh, wings and Philly cheesesteaks. Oh, we're loving Because that. we ended up actually trying to do, uh, you know, we upgraded some systems and fun. just were making Philly cheesesteaks and they were killing them. Yeah? Yeah, they were killing the cheese. I love that. Gonna fuck this up. <laughs> Alright, Rebecca doesn't know how to wrap sandwiches. I never worked in food service. Okay. I worked at CBS. I worked at CBS. I know how to do film. Rebecca. I know how to 
to film and I'm one of those little machines. You're doing great. The stinger. We're going in for the stinger. There's like all new stuff I haven't tried. Yeah. All right. So that's a buffalo thing. That's like a original buffalo thing. Is it? Okay. Yeah, sure. <laughs> there is a chicken tender in here. You uh -huh. can't tell, but there is one. Mm -hmm. mm. I can. I found the chicken tender. I do too. Good to meet you, Mm. Mm. Uh, yeah, sure. I mean, it's chopped up right here. Sure. Yeah, sure. I'm gonna take another bite of that, actually. That is um, surprising. surprising. The meat tastes really good in there. Yes. I did again. Finally find the chicken tender deep in there. Searching for it. Can I think about it? Did you put like a barbecue chicken tender in there? Honey barbecue. Honey barbecue, yeah. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> Another, I need another sippy sip. We have one more sandwich to try. This is not food you eat politely. This is absolutely first date food. Test them. Test them. Yeah, this is messy, delicious hand food. See how well he cleans up after himself. <laughs> Test him. This is I would first fail. Day. I would fail. <laughs> this is absolutely 100%. You heard it here first. This is first date food because you want to know how well he cleans up. Okay, this is like the ketchup test. Have you seen it? This is the ketchup test, but it's for first dates. You don't want hot sauce. <laughs> I'm so full. Okay. Last one is the chopped cheese. Chopped cheese. The PA series is. I was gonna say it's the one I am the most excited for, and this is the main difference. I understand is that it's burger meat versus like shaved steak or something. Yeah, so it's not the same as a Philly cheesesteak. The chopped cheese. Oh. <laughs> uh, who's making a mess now? <laughs> Cheers. But you see like at the bottom it has like the lettuce, mayonnaise, like you would expect, and then the top is the burger mixed with the house sauce. I want a bite of it all and I'm not sure I'm gonna be able to. Let's see. Let's do it. Let's go. That was really good. I like the mix of like lettuce, tomato, mayonnaise with the top beef. I can never say it right. It's like a burger, but on a sandwich. Yes. Wow, chopped cheese. Chopped cheese. Final notes. Yes. So I think my favorite thing I tried was the Loganberry wings. I think because it's such like a revelation. Never had it before loved it and then the next thing would be oh gosh that's a toss-up between the fries and this but honestly it's because those flavors are similar like they had the toppings of like the stinger on the fries yeah. right so it tasted very similar like you need the steak mix the house sauce with the sour let's go fries let's go fries all of it all of it i loved everything um the chopped cheese the chopped cheese was really good um the loaded fries Ooh. The loaded fries were amazing. Um, everything was good. The sausage was good. The wings were good. The buffalo was a little, a little tangy for me because I'm a wuss. But the wings were good. The loganberry, oh my god, you have to get those. Um, everything. I think the chopped cheese might have been my favorite. So before we headed out for Rebecca's birthday dinner, we had a little development meeting with everybody's studios. This is where we're actually going to be professionally producing our podcast, uh, at least for the next couple of months. So we're super excited about it and yeah, did a little planning and can't wait to show you guys everything that we have in store. So like where oh, I you're getting your purse. Too much. Well, now we're definitely doing the outfit. Well, we have to, you have to be able to get all of us. Okay, get in. Oh, you want to go in? Okay. Well, I want you to be in the middle because it's your birthday. Uh huh.
And we're laughing at you. Oh okay, we did it. Okay. Welcome to the gown time for Trout Plus. And for those of you who are coming for the first time, <laughs> I'm a little nutty. <laughs> Obviously. We know. We know. POV. <laughs> Tommy, what are what are your thoughts? Hands down. Feelings? Elite. Elite. Agreed. Nobody can top that. Agreed. <laughs> Touchdown. <laughs> she died. <laughs> Told him. Happy dance. <laughs> <laughs> I get all the treats. Yum, yum, yum. That's a face. The face is called a cute. Good on you. Are you familiar with Pandan? I've had it once prior. Uh, water beans and like a latte. Like, uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's all in the wrist. It's all in the wrist. <laughs> Get some of that green goodness. Oh, yes. Yes. <laughs> There's the panda. Thank you. Let's yes, see, Erica. Enjoy. Cheers. <laughs> What you want, babe? Yes. I like vanilla, and I usually like it with vanilla, but I'm down to whatever. I'm down for whatever. I'm down for whatever. It's like a nice. It's light. Like, oh, <laughs> just make it happen. Give me some caffeine. Yes, ma'am. Thanks, babe. I love you. 
Ubi. Verdict? Ubi pudding. Yeah? All right. I'm trying to just taste vanilla -y. Okay. It's like vanilla, but fun. I love that. Mm -hmm. I love that for you. It's like me. <laughs> what are you getting, Rebecca? Getting the coconut. The coconut. Coconut. It's very satisfying, so. Um, Alyssa wants me to get her something, and she's very specific. What does she want? I don't know. Vanilla. Vanilla, matcha. I'm sure that can happen. you guys to understand that I'm currently watching Alyssa try to figure out how to thread a particular bead onto her onto her bracelet and it, it might be one of the funniest things I've seen Alyssa She's been asking for like 20 minutes how how to thread one bead onto this bracelet. It's a dangly. <laughs> what? It is a dangly. It's a dangly bead. In her defense, it's a dangly bead. Stay tuned for the finished product. What you making? What's he gonna say? Mr. Kitty. Mr. Kitty. Are you making it for Chase? No, I'm Mr. Kitty. Oh, you're Mr. Kitty. Yeah. <laughs> He's a little squish. But I'm Mr. Kitty. You're Mr. Kitty. I love that for you. So much. You look very cute today, by the way. I know I've said that a million times. And you should keep saying it. I will. I need it on repeat. Okay. <laughs> I messed up already. <laughs> I'm just going to keep it on you. The entire episode is just going to be you. Oh, right. You making a friendship bracelet. <laughs> I would watch it, honestly. <laughs> I can't even tell what colors these are. Doing great. You want my glasses? Um, I don't think that helps with colors. You're right. <laughs> You're right. Also, I think we tried that and I blinded you with my glasses. Yeah, your glasses are not great. I'm sorry. And I thought I had bad vision, but you. <laughs> I'm sorry. We're doing it. We're doing it. I think I've done it wrong. Were these what you wanted to use in between your letters? Um, yeah. And then you just decided not to? Yeah. I got distracted by the other thing. <laughs> But we can always untie and add the end. 
You're doing amazing, sweetie. Thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> Don't be surprised on Tuesday when this entire episode <laughs> just, it's just you making a friendship bracelet. <laughs> I didn't even have the patience to make one. I have... I can't. Mr. Key. No. <laughs> What's it say? Sat. I love it. Thank you. I might be locked and loaded, but not too locked and loaded. No one's going to talk shit about me. <laughs> All she said was she. No one else is about to talk shit. You know what they say, talk shit get hit. Talk shit get hit. This is recording. This is going in. It's going in. Alyssa's bullying me. Maria? You can't turn my own joke against me. Watch me. Maria, I can't see. Can you see me? So we wanted to give you guys a little sneak at our speed friending uh, that we did during our Galentine's event for Charlotte Plus. We had such a good time. Um, and we basically just like rotated chairs and asked each other some fun questions to get to know each other a little better. It was really fun having some new faces and of course some returning faces as well. It was such a great time spending time with everybody before the Super Bowl on Sunday. We had gotcha matcha there, so we had great matcha lattes and some fun treats. We had Girl Scout cookies, so, you know, we love those, obviously. <laughs> we had a photo booth. Um, we just had a great time spending time with each other, and we had such a great turnout. And, yeah, this is why we love our fat community. Okay. We're watching the Super Bowl. I'm wearing Alyssa's 90. You look beautiful. Produce. It's got pineapples on it. I'm having some mild. Hi. <laughs> We've had fun today. We did have fun. I'm tired. I don't know how I'm still here, but I am. Hi. <laughs> I like the barbecue better than like mom. He is. He's physical. Oh, you did it so fast. I came from deep. I was recording. <laughs> I'm such a lady. Let's go in there. We're leaving that in there. Again. 